Welcome back, YouTubers. It's uh, Tripod002 uh, with a video update. Um, I have a, a couple of pictures that I'm going to post prior to this video so you guys can see what the... Uh, I don't know if you remember the Corvette I did the uh, the flames on to, uh, to show you how to do flames. Uh, I was uh, redoing that car. And uh, what I come up with is I'm going to be doing a auto body shop diorama and the car in picture right now uh, the Mako Shark will be one of the cars that's uh, that will be in the diorama uh, I'm going to build that from scratch building and uh, and everything so that's that's going to be up on the block that'll be I'll just show you a work in progress on that because that's going to take some time um, well when you see the uh, what I've come up with here for the uh, Corvette. This is going to be another one of the body shop works. And uh, bring it around here. And uh, what I did is I, I took the car and I, I soaked it in some brake fluid for a little while and just broke the paint down so that it just went through to the original color and most of the, uh, the white and the flames came off. And then I just sanded through the burgundy to the white primer underneath. I uh, changed the wheels on it. So let's move uh, the camera around it. See you on that. Turn my light back so you can see it really good. Um, It looks pretty good, you know, and that's going to be uh, one of the cars in the junkyard on uh, the uh, body shop diorama. Uh, windshield is in there, broken windshield frame. Um, no engine; it's all painted inside, ready for an engine. I uh, got an engine sitting over there on the side with the top. So I don't know if I'm going to put that in there, or you know, maybe just. Build an engine stand here, showing that the engine's getting put in. But uh, it looks pretty good for uh, for a body shop piece. So there's two cars for the body shop: that one and that one over there. And I'm going to try to find a, a tow truck at one of the model shops, so I can uh, or a flatbed tow truck, so I can get a car tow being towed in. And uh, that's pretty much it for today. I mean, uh, I got some other stuff going on. I think I'm bringing the Nova in, the uh, 66 Nova. I'm going to do that next. My son is working on his uh, GTR. Um, like I was telling you guys, it's molded in gold plastic. But there are some issues with the with the gold. You just can't shoot clear on this. You could see that line. Going right down the almost the middle of the going down the middle of the trunk and almost the middle of the roof, and it looks like it would have a ridge on it, but it's it's smooth. So I'm gonna have to prime it and get some gold paint and paint it. But uh, my son's working on that. Here's the rims he's gonna be using. They're pretty sharp rims. Your gold to match the car. Um, there's not too much to the to it. It's uh, as you can see, he's just got the chassis, the wheels. There's no engine. Uh, there's only a few trays. Got some chrome parts on this side over here. That's pretty much it for the. Uh, for that. He just started on that tonight, so. Uh, and maybe we'll get that done by the weekend. Um, we still got to put decals on the plane. The Integra is done. Um, and he got your your messages, guys. He says thanks for all the uh, the props out there. Um, for now, I'm gonna say uh, we'll be talking to you soon, and I'll uh, I'll keep.
keep you updated on the diorama. And I'll be working on the uh, the 66 Nova tomorrow. And that, I'm doing some different stuff. I've already um, started working on the chassis. And I've cut the uh, the wheel wells out of the chassis to fit the tires. Uh, and I'm going to make uh, that sort of a low rider. I'm going to try to get it as low as possible. So the uh, tires are already hitting the body when it's on there. So uh, tires might be too big. I might have to shorten the tires a little bit. But That's it for now, guys. There you have it. Auto body shop stuff coming up. Everybody have a good night. Peace.